Alright, my name is Will. I'm a second year undergraduate law student here at Cambridge and I'm going to talk to you today about the main teaching methods on the course. There are supervisions and lectures. Supervisions are small group teaching sessions between two and four students and an academic. The academic is generally a world leader in their field who's written textbooks and articles so is really an expert in the field. For a supervision you do a set amount of reading in advance, you'd read textbooks, cases and statutes and of course articles sometimes written by the supervisor. So in supervisions we do what we do in the law degree. We look at what the law is. You generally get an idea of this from your textbook reading. But you then analyse the law and interpret the law. The law can have different meanings. It's not always clear what a statutory provision means. Sometimes words can have various different meanings and really deciding what meaning should be attributed to the statute is what we look at. Sometimes the law doesn't give a clear outcome in a particular situation and we discuss that as well. We also ask ourselves, is the law satisfactory? Should it be the way it is? Certainly, the law may not always seem satisfactory. For example, is the law on squatters satisfactory? Should pe people be able to get other people's land for free? Is it right that you can be convicted of murder without having an intention to kill? So we discuss all these contentious aspects in supervisions. You can voice your own opinion and put it to scrutiny to these supervisors who have made this subject their life's work. And that's particularly amazing, I find, about the system at Cambridge. You get to think about the law, and you're encouraged to think in different ways. Supervisors will generally give you different perspectives on the work. Supervisors will have thought about the work, written books, written articles, so are very experienced in their field. And it just feels amazing to be in their company sometimes. Also in supervisions, I feel that my communication skills have dramatically improved. You get to express yourself, express your ideas very clearly and concisely, and that's what I find has particularly improved. So there are four supervisions in a term, and you are required to do two essays for each course in the term. Essays are submitted to your supervisor and you get very detailed feedback on the essays, so very clear marking. And I think that this is such a good way to improve for your exams and for future essays and for your future career as well. Another particular beneficial aspect about supervisions is that you are discussing the law not just with the supervisor, but with other students who are highly motivated and very smart as well. And they also give very interesting aspects and perspectives to the course, which you would not necessarily have thought before. So that's particularly beneficial as well. Also, there may be times where you don't understand what you've read in a textbook, before the supervision or even for the supervision. What, you, what I find you can do with supervisors, particularly at Cambridge, who are very friendly, is you can just email them. Email the person who wrote your textbook a query, and they will get back to you surprisingly quickly as well, which I find very, very amazing. As well as supervisions, there are also lectures. They are delivered to the whole year, so around 200 people in core subjects and slightly less in your option subjects in the second and third year. They are, again, delivered by experts. It's a really good way to take in a lot of information in a short space of time. Lectures give you an overview of the law, and they are delivered with PowerPoints and handouts. You generally take notes, either by your laptop or on paper, and after lectures, there is still a social aspect to the law faculty, which revolves around the law faculty's cafe, where they serve sumptuous brownies. After that, you can go to the Squire Law Library, where they have endless amounts of books, so you can do work there, or you can go back to college and do work there. So in your working week, it's mostly spent towards 
supervision reading, lecture handouts and your lecture notes will supplement it, but the supervision reading is the most important thing. But even with all of that, there is always enough time for a social aspect to your Cambridge life. <laughs>